Well, I grew up in Dallas, Oregon, as did my husband. We both went through school there, graduated together, and then I started undergraduate school in Canada, actually, but they didn't have an engineering program, so when my husband and I got married in the middle of undergrad, I transferred to Oregon State, and we both graduated from there. And then after that, we ended up moving to Southern California, so I could complete medical school at Loma Linda University. And then following that, I took a year off. I had my daughter, Addison, during my last year of medical school. So I took a year off and stayed home with her, which was a fantastic year, and it allowed my husband some time to travel with his company. And then we moved to North Carolina for residency, and we've been there for the last four years. So I'm an obstetrician and gynecologist, or an OBGYN you typically hear, which means I take care of moms who are pregnant throughout the pregnancy, the delivery, and the postpartum care. And in addition to that, I take care of any female issues for the gynecology, which could be birth control to abnormal bleeding to surgical concerns like a hysterectomy. Well, I, of course, think that OBGYN is the best area of medicine and the most exciting. There are several things. There are very few surgical specialties that also still allow you to have continuity with patients and you can follow someone from prescribing birth control to all of their pregnancies to then postmenopausal care. I could follow a patient, her daughters, their daughters possibly, and so it allows for a lot of continued care, which is extraordinarily nice. Um, and I really enjoy the hands-on and the surgery side of it as well. McMinnville was a really logical choice for us. Growing up in Dallas, just 30 minutes away, we knew we wanted to return to the Willamette Valley. My husband's family actually still own farmland and a farmhouse out in Sheridan, so he spent a lot of time in this area, and his family have been coming to this hospital since, I guess I would say that would be around 80, 81 when his brother came here and my sister-in-law was born here at our old location. And so I feel like we've been part of this community before we were really even here. And so it's nice to come home. In my free time, I really enjoy any sort of do-it-yourself activities, anything from we've remodeled several homes to making furniture inside the home or smaller projects, knitting, painting. My daughter also enjoys anything crafty, so we spend a lot of time doing that. And in addition, we also like to spend time outdoors, hiking, and just anything where we can all be together as a family. I'm thrilled to be joining Valley Women's Health, establishing roots in this area, and providing great care to women in this community.